Wow, what an incredible operation here. Farm-raised tuna, the best here and actually in all of Japan. Won some national awards. Here's on. This is so incredible to see, huh? Yeah. All this stuff that. going on back here, you guys. Um, farm raised the most sustainable bluefin tuna, the best tasting. Again, they won national awards over here. You guys gotta see the whole entire video and the whole process and coming up. Obviously, it's very, very uh, gory back there. Uh, not really suitable for YouTube, so we're not gonna show that. Maybe it'll be an unlisted video, but we'll see. Or maybe it'll be on the Patreon channel, but definitely um, great operation to see. You know, everyone's saying yeah. that bluefin's been overfished, not at all with all these different farms Today's a day, a day of 60 pieces right 60 pieces right yeah yeah that's a lot this place is massive out here and this is in Kochi Japan where your hometown is here oh yeah but I haven't yeah. been to the school this is my, my first time yeah first time right first time for you and first time for me yeah <laughs> first time for both this kind of reminds me of the Faroe Islands huh take a look at this beautiful scenery out here this area though it's pretty actually very very cool right now it's about 50 degrees or so out here in Kochi yeah, and exactly it, like a federal island right yeah. yeah it looks like the fjords here but yeah look at this beautiful scenery but the best thing to do is sustainable sustainable bluefin tuna is the best way to go you see they're feeding the tuna of this over there the processes they're putting it on a hook once they throw it in there with the bait on the hook, they yank it right away. And of course, there's a big bluefin tuna on the other end that just grabs it. And that's when they're brought up on deck over here. Immediately Kijimi style. And look at the size of the hook on there. This is not easy work. Let me tell you, they gotta grab that cord right away. There he goes, there he goes. Alright guys, so this is the end. We got 60 bluefin tuna in here. If you didn't catch us on YouTube Live, we showed this whole thing when it was happening. You got all the guts from the 60 pieces that come my series here. Some of the hearts are still moving. Tuna hearts stay beating for quite some time, even after they're removed. Anyway, totally sustainable. About to get back on shore. And it's been such a privilege to be out here in Kochi, Japan. Hero's hometown. And this is the very western part of it. He's never even been here. And Kochi is actually the 17th largest prefecture in Japan. Total is 47. I think they're 17 or 18. That's what I was told yesterday.
前室ですねでこちらはあの当店温泉こういったものですね。わあ、this is like the vault。わあ、ほう。なんでいろいろそのマグロもこの中骨だとか、こういうのもあの居酒屋さんとかで。結構使われている。見てみます。What's the temperature in here? Negative what? Negative sixty. Oh, Toro. Beautiful. Chutoro. Oh, Chutoro. Okay. Wow, look at this. This place is cold. Very cold. Hero san, where are you going? Come on. Oh, look at him. Look at him go. Yeah, it's very cold in there. Oh, this is what they feed the tuna. Yeah, we saw that earlier. This is what they feed to get the tuna to come out. This is one ton. One ton, right here. Usually, one thousand eight hundred ton. アメリカの方からすると規模はちっちゃいですけど、でもまあマグロの餌としてただあの四十トンとか一日で食べるんで、それを考えると全然一日四十トンですか？ええ、そうですね。この養殖場のマグロが。The farm they 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 eat forty ton a day. Forty tons a day. The tuna. Yeah. Wow. And where's the fish from? この魚はどちらの方から？えっと前浜で取れたマキアミで取ったですね。でそのマキアミの会社もあの一社あのあるんですよ。カネギ業で。ただそこがまあそこが競りにかかってうちが買えれば入ってきたりとか、目の前でこう取れるので取れるような魚をあの凍結したり。Oh yeah, my chicken. My chicken. Ah, so it's a chicken. Ah, how do you want? How cold is it? Is that super freezer also? That one super freezer? Forty, forty, minus forty, minus forty. 